So the reason why I came is because of two different things. One, Oswego is kind of the home away from home for me. The house that my parents purchased was actually a summer home. So I would come here every summer and winter whenever I had vacations so that I could enjoy time here at Oswego. They have a good meteorology department. Al Roker went here, one of the biggest names, you know, in TV news. So I thought that this was gonna be a really good opportunity for me to come here. I have a house right across the street and I'm going to a great meteorology department. So I am working with WTOP. I uh, was elected this summer to be the chief meteorologist for this year for Storm Team 10, which is the meteorologist section of news. So I was very grateful for that. Meteorology department here, they really prep you. And a lot of people don't understand with the meteorology major that there's a lot more than you know, just looking at clouds, looking at models, looking at the weather. It's very intense in calculus and physics and chemistry. We use all of that in our major pretty much every single day. And I think SUNY Oswego, the professors here in the meteorology department do a really good job of helping to teach us and explain these really like intense and very intricate concepts so that we could apply it in our major. It just makes it so much easier for us to explain to someone who's not a meteorology major what all of this stuff is. And that's especially important when you're on TV news because you're talking to people, you're talking to viewers that don't understand, you know, a lot of the hard meteorology concepts that we learn about. So we really need to break it down so that it's easy for them to understand. And SUNY Oswego, the professors here, do an amazing job of preparing us to do that.